can see where they were sitting. Yeah. It's his butt. <laughs> what? What's open. It says open me. Nothing. What the heck? Maybe it's for here. I guess we're not using the microwave today. <laughs> I guess they're playing on popcorn. Yep. Poppy. If anyone had to use the mic, if anyone has to use the microwave today, yeah, they're not. Crazy. Oh, licorice, you're probably right. Licorice. 39th question. Milk duds. Milk, yeah, milk duds. Milk duds. How was your day, Ivy? Good. Good. What did you do at school? We did new ABCs. Oh, new ABCs? Oh, wait, no. New song. Cool. That's all I'm saying. How are you doing, Eden? Good. Good? Mm -hmm. She stayed home from school today because she had a fever. Okay. Are you feeling better? Way better. I'm making lunch in the Instant Pot. Have these pinto beans dried. You can use pinto beans, black beans, probably any beans, but I've only done pinto and black. I just put enough to cover the bottom and this will make a few cups of cooked beans maybe like three or four i can't really remember but it doesn't matter like unless you're using a recipe where you need a certain amount but i'll eat off these for a few days okay so i cover the beans with a couple inches of water and then i am i'm going to seal the instant pot and I'm put it on bean for an hour and that's it. The beans are done. So now what I do is I just drain most of the water out, like 95% of it. Just leave a little bit of water so that they have enough liquid that when you mash them, they stay kind of like a refried bean texture basically, but without the oil. And then I'll add taco seasoning and some vegetable bouillon just to give it some flavor. And then I, you can just eat them like that or you can mix them with rice. I do both, and then I think I'm also going to make crunch wraps at some point this week, and I'll use these in that. I just got a package from Target. Um, the kids have a birthday party on Sunday if they are feeling well enough because Eden has a pretty bad fever right now and I'm assuming Ivy won't be far behind. Yeah. Um, but it's going to be a fairy party. So for a gift, I got her the tooth fairy doll for Jenny. Um, it's like Target's version of an American Girl doll. So that's what I got for her gift. And then while I was shopping for that, these came up and they're little tooth fairy pillows. So I got one for each of the girls 
and I feel like this was only like five or ten bucks so it wasn't even that expensive and it's pretty small it's like five by five if that this little tooth is actually a pocket so that's where you stick the tooth and you can either like hang it up on the doorknob or you could stick it on their bed or under the pillow hi poppy but I thought that was cool because you know not only is it a cute little thing but also um, if you hang it on the doorknob it doesn't disturb them while they're sleeping so I got one for Eden and one for Ivy she hasn't lost any teeth yet but it'll be soon and I just got this poppy I just got this package which was addressed to Jake's best friend, but with our address, so I assumed it was from him. Jake told me that he thought that it was wrapped gifts for us, but it's a projector. So I'm thinking he just sent us a projector. Why are you putting your elves back in their bed? Because they had too much fun. They had what? You say that louder? They had too much fun. When? Today. And so now they're in their beds? Probably a good idea so they can rest up for tonight, huh? Are going for a ride? Well, I didn't, I didn't touch them because I'm Is that sad. salt? No. It looks mm -hmm. like salt. salt. It's magic crystals from the North Pole. Yeah. And it needs to gain its Christmas magic, so it's going back in the tree. How are you back. feeling, Bob? Good. Good. Just took medicine. I'm feeling good. You got the Christmas flu? Um, also, it's a flu um, that Santa I, brings you if you've been I, bad. I only, um, I only take the witness. Yeah, that's the one you like. Yeah. The berry. She don't want to be. I like the berry. Probably won't be going to gymnastics today, huh? No, if I was going, I would be out there. Nope, you wouldn't yet. You'd still be in school right now. But we're gonna hopefully we can do it on Friday instead. I oh, know they don't. They 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 change oh, designs daddy. all the time. Daddy, daddy. It's really it's really coming apart now. So sad. How long, what'd you buy this for me? I think I bought that for our anniversary like years ago. I've had it for a long long time. Yeah. Is it just starting to break or? Oh no no it's it's in rough shape. Well, here's the thing, Jake. If you had more than like three yeah. hoodies, you could rotate it yeah. more often and then it Want wouldn't be so worn. But I like this one. I'm not hungry. So I wear it. Um, as you may well be aware, uh, Emily recently made some stockings and they were hanging on that wall. The issue we're having is no one can decide what order they're supposed to be in. I think the perfect order is me being surrounded by my children and everyone else can go wherever they want but the kids have a different idea. So no one can decide, so we're drawing lots. Uh, so we have eight pieces of paper, and then we're gonna do them in the order we eight. draw them. Or six. Okay. Um, however, however, if, oh, you know what, where are those two pieces of paper? Yeah, we're gonna do eight pieces of paper. Ready for this? We're gonna do eight pieces of paper. Why eight? Well, you'll know. Thank you, Grammy. You'll get to know. Okay, so there's gonna be two blank ones. Okay. Two blank ones. And the reason for that is if you draw a blank one, you get to pick. You get to pick whose name is going next. Okay? Oh, actually, there's one blank. Let's make it even more fun. One blank, and there's one X. What happens if you get the X? If you get an X, you get to take someone's down, and we put the name back in the bucket. All right? Mm -hmm. You ready for this? Yep. Yeah. B-E-A-U-D-F-O. I don't want any cheating. I don't want any hitting below the belt. I don't want any screaming. Hi. I don't want any crying. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> I put it in. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Everyone's in. So if you get the blank one, you get to pick a name and put it wherever you want. Okay. If you get the X, you get to take someone's down. So let's say you wanted to be in the first position, and you, but it's already taken by Ivy, right? If you draw the X, you can take that one down. So that way you have another chance to go up there. <laughs> All right, who's drawing first? Oh, I didn't spit it. Ah, just... oh, you lost them. Whoops. Okay. All right, who's picking first? Me. Did we get them all? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. I'm going first. Holy, we can't, you know, it's just decision after decision. How are we going to decide who's going first? Anyone got a coin? All right, here's what we're going to do. Holy, another game. Because I don't feel like mediating, so we're just going to let fate parent I'll you let, today. I'll, I'll let Ivy go. That's all right, I got a game for it. Okay. It's very easy. I'm thinking of a number between one and ten. Okay. Whoever gets closest to my number gets to pick first. All right, and go. What number between one and ten? Seven. Okay, I think nine. Oh, Ivy's closer. The number was four. Uh, so All right, Ivy. Ivy. Close your eyes. Wait. Put that on. Okay. This is great. I got everything I need right here. What's going on? Stars are aligning. <laughs> I always forget. I know. All right. Can you see? All right, go ahead and pick one piece of paper. <laughs> one piece of paper. One piece of paper and then hand it. I'll, I'll pick it up out of the bucket and I'll take it from you. First spot is... Anyone want to guess? Me. Eden! So Eden's in the first spot. Okay, yeah. so Ivy, can you go put Eden's sock in the first spot? Yeah. Thanks, girl. Eden's turn to draw. Blindfold. This one's Eden. Yes, it is. Don't lose it, because if someone gets a blank or an X, all mixed up, go ahead and pick Eden Jane. Okay. Next up is... It's Ivy! <laughs> what? So two names are already out. Eden and Ivy. But if you still pick a blank, you can decide who goes next. If you get to pick an X, you can take someone down. So the game's not over. We are on draw number three. It is Ivy Bivy's turn to draw. Lower the blindfold and put your hand in the bucket. What? What? <laughs> anytime. Anytime. Hello? You're Ivy! All right. Three, two... You'll never guess who it is. No one! All right, Ivy. You get to pick whoever you want. You can pick Eden. You can pick Ivy. You can pick Grammy. You can pick Grampy. You can pick Daddy. You can pick Mommy. You get to take whoever you want and put it on any of the remaining hooks. Oh, you don't want to take Eden or Ivy down? You like where they are? Okay. You're picking Daddy? Hey, Daddy. Daddy. All right, blindfold is on. Can you see? No. And pick. <laughs> ah, that was fast. And you got mommy. <laughs> this is going in a very satisfying order for being randomized, <laughs> if I do say so myself. Put your blindfold on before I gouge your eyes out with my own fingers. Thank you. All right, here we go. All right, here we go. All right. All right, are we ready? All right, are we ready? What? What's that? Oh, laughing's not so fun anymore, is it? All right, you ready to pick? And pick from the bucket. Next up is. Next up is. Grampy! So that means Grammy goes last. Not necessarily. They could pick an X. Oh. All right, there's three left in here. Pick. Not the X. 
It is Grammy. Why Whoa. no one got the X? What about the wow. four elves? They don't get stockings. They make the stuff that goes into the stockings. Well, there you have it. I don't like this pattern. You don't like it? No. The universe has decided. And if I say they did a really good job, Eden, Ivy, Dad, Mom, Gra Grampy, Grammy? Yeah. Because that was how we decided it would be. Please. I don't like it. We'll have to vote to veto the pattern and start over. Yeah, I want to start over. Oh, well, we got to vote first. Yeah. Okay, fine. Okay, Ivy, we have to vote. Fine. Eden doesn't like the pattern. Does it? Even though I spent my time to develop the rules. Draw the names, find the paper, find the marker, come up with the game, come up with the X, come up with the blank, on the fly, did the game, found the blindfold, she doesn't like the pattern. So we gotta change it. Well, we gotta vote. So if you don't like the pattern, then when I ask, raise your hand. If you do like the pattern, raise your hand. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. If you don't like the pattern, are you voting? Yeah. We need a tiebreaker. Okay. Okay. Then my mom will vote. That was that was picked at random. That was random pick. Yep. And it turned out pretty well. Listen up. If you want the pattern to be changed, raise your hand. And if you want it to stay the same, raise your hand. Hey, it stays the same. <laughs> <laughs> this is just the year, the Vlogmas year of being served dinner because Jake just made me a BLT.